What's up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, <laughs> trolls and citizens, the JJs and PPs? It's your boy X11 Newman giving you a video about Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, as well as Dragon Ball Super, as well as Final Fantasy 15. You know, just rolling off the cuffs with my mind and what I've been thinking about lately and in this business that we call life. You know, a couple of days ago, I was sitting down on my couch, uh, currently eating some sushi to uh, uh, make the Asian side of my heritage and ancestors proud. Um, and as I was doing that, sipping that, you know, my sister calls me and is like, yo, I got to tell you something about this, right? I'm like, about what? Like, what are we talking about? What are we going with this Beanie Seagull and game and Meek are having beef? I don't got time for this shit. Kim Kardashian got robbed. Um, I heard they robbed um, a, a piece of the, uh, of, of a, her, uh, uh, was it the breast implants? Um, so I, I'm, I'm fucked up in my mind. I'm going crazy right now. I'm like, please, God, save us. I'm ready for the world to end. I'm ready for, you know, UFOs to come down and, 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 and you know, destroy us all. And then a little glimpse of hope comes in because my sister goes, you know, hey, by the way, um, you know, Final Fantasy 15 has this new like engine and stuff like that. So you should check it out and see it. My sister, by the way, is a huge Final Fantasy fan, crazy Final Fantasy fan, also an aspiring model, blah, 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 blah. Um, so, you know, she shows me this footage and stuff like that. I'm like going over her house because I'm helping her out with with luggages and stuff like that because that's what real men do. Um, you know, I'm, 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 you know, pulling, you know, helping her with refrigerators and moving stuff because she's moving to Los Angeles. And, you know, I want to help her out with that, you know, and that's because that's what real men do. You guys wouldn't know anything about that because you're virgins and you're losers and you're de dweebs and dorks and you don't know even the pimples that are around a woman's nipples or breast. You don't know the little bumps around the vagina and stuff like that. You don't know anything about that. You know more about the hair on the scrotum mm. or the size of the penis hole. You probably know the actual measures, um, but you don't know anything about being a man. So. I'm helping her with that. She shows me this footage. Now, mind you, again, like I said, Kim Kardashian, Benny Siegel, The Game, Meek Mill. I'm fucked up in my mind right now, you know? I was actually thinking about getting some breast implants till I heard Kim Kardashian got her breast implants robbed. When I heard that, I was like, no, I'm not doing this now. I, I can't, I can't. I wouldn't want somebody taking out my breast implants. That would, that would be, that would suck. Um, so she shows me this footage and I see that the new footage of the Final Fantasy. It's a guy, like a chunky man. He's really chunky, um, waving his hand. I think he was a hand model or something like that, inspiring hand model. And when I saw that, I was like, wow. I think I'm back in the hype again. Um, however, you know, it looked great. It looked better because they fixed the engine a little bit. So you can see the engine's fixed. You can see that uh, they made things better and that they improved on the graphics and stuff like that. Of course, I'm not one of those people that's super hyper about graphics either. I'm not that kind of guy because I'm back in a day in the 90s where I was playing fucking Tomb Raider, you know, with her pixelated breasts and titties and, and ass and, you know, playing with Snake who looked like somebody drew him and then took a, you know, a, a kindergarten eraser on his face. Like, you know, I'm, I'm from that era. so. I love video games, period. This new generation, if you talk to most people, you're really all about hype. You know, I, I want to, I love Uncharted. You know, I, I sometimes look at Drake's cock. And, you know, I, sometimes I fantasize about Sasuke's ass. And if I had to choose who I wanted to fuck between Sasuke and, and, and Sakura, you know, you'd say out loud Sakura. That's what you would say out loud. Um, but most of the anime gay community, deep down inside, at the end of the day would want to be in between Sasuke's uh, uh, booty um, or him pounding them. Either way they would go. Actually, actually, I really honestly would bet they would be the bottom. Um, uh, shout out to the bottoms out there, all you, you, you guys out there. But anyway, that equals Final Fantasy 15. So I'm going to Final Fantasy 15 
and I'm seeing this footage and stuff and it looks great, it looks amazing, the graphics are enhanced. Everything looks cool. But I don't know what, I got this weird feeling like, oh man, you know, is this game gonna be repetitive? And let me explain what I mean by repetitive. I mean, is the battle system gonna be repetitive? Are, is it gonna be a game where you end up sort of, you know, not going anywhere in terms of the battle system and stuff? You know, I'm hoping that it has fertility, um, virtuosity. Uh, uh, um, uh, I hope it has flexibility. Mm, I hope it has, uh, you know, it's, it, it's legs open wide for me to insert that, that cock. Um, and when I mean by that, I mean mentally, you know, because overall Final Fantasy 15 looks amazing. It looks incredible. And, you know, I'm, you know, I'm sitting there, uh, I'm looking at the footage, you know, the chunky hand model, um, really fat chubby guy. I'm looking at that thing, looking at chubby chunk and, and seeing how it looks to stuff like that. And I'm like, wow, this game looks amazing, but I hope it's not repetitive. Uh, we got one more month. It's October 11th, yeah. So we got one more month for this game to come out. Mm, excuse me, for this game to come out. Really actually two months technically since it comes out at the end of November, which to be honest, I don't really count as coming out in November, like November 29th, 28th or something like that. Like, yeah, whatever, that's December. That's December, that's when it's coming out. But um, you know, the holidays coming out, you know, so, 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 so Final Fantasy 15, that's what's been on my mind lately with that. But I've been staying away from that, sort of just waiting and just waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting till the release date comes. I've been pretty patient about it, actually. I'm not really over-hyped about it. The hypes went down a little bit, uh, which is the same for Xenoverse and World of Final Fantasy, which is the other ones I want to uh, actually get on now, which is Xenoverse 2. We'll start with that. Second, you know, um, I was watching YouTube, and I'm going on YouTube, and it just shows you what the world's coming to. Trolls, not, trolls are dying, first of all. First of all, let's get that straight, by the way. Let's get that straight. The days of trolls are dying. Do you know why? Because I can say that because I'm the king of trolls. I'm the king of trolls. You wanna know why I'm the king of trolls? Because I don't just troll online. Oh, no, 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 no. First of all, I've been trolling since 2002. Get that straight. Second of all, I troll in your face. I don't troll just online. And I could go through my resume of all my trolls, but the real nigga don't need to. You get what I'm saying, fool? Huh? Do you get where I'm going with this? Huh? You wanna know why half of me, half of the Mark Anthony community, which is the Spanish community, half of the uh, uh, black community uh, of and the gay and you know the cartoon community known as the nigger nerds and 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 the nigger specs i mean and the, no no and the and the, the um the anime uh, specs and the cracker nerds and and, and the spec nerds and 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 and, and uh, this, the, 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 you know all 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 the ones you can think of do you know why it's falling do you know why because trolls are dying every time somebody tries to troll me whether it's on GTA GTA, for example, always saying the same shit. First of all, I'm not offended by words. But if I was, if I was, how can you be offended by words when people say the same shit? You know it's bad when I can repeat what you already heard before. Your mom sucks dick for a living. You're a fag. You're a noob. You're gay. Shut the fuck up. You suck. You're trash. Can we come up with anything original anymore? Anything. You know, you got clowns now attacking people left and right. You got Ronald McDonald's going around all over the town, all over the city. A couple of days ago, I was walking by McDonald's and I saw Ronald McDonald crying. He was crying literally on the, on, on the, 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 the ground, like, like on the stairs of McDonald's. I went to him and bought him a fry and guess what? He didn't want it. Now listen, listen, listen. When Ronald McDonald doesn't want to eat fries that you bought for him, and he's crying, you know, his makeup and his lipstick's all coming down, his face looking like a real bitch. 
When that happens, you begin to realize something's wrong. Not only that, his hair was off. To be honest, I think it was. I think he was a nigger. I think he was because he had nappy, a real nappy afro, like really bad. Like, like I think I could have sworn there was one time where I was like, he was right crying. He was like, <laughs> the clouds messed up my life. And then I said, here's a fry. And he's like, oh no, oh no, <laughs> going to Popeyes. I'm like, what the fuck? Popeyes, you know, so that's what I'm seeing in my life, you know, completely, you know, the black side of me is going, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, stop this, you know, if all lives matter, then black lives matter, correct, there's nothing wrong with the idea of black lives matter being something, when white people, when crackers say, when white devils say stuff, you know, the white side of me comes out of that again too, because I, I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with black lives matter? You know, like, okay, picture it this way. When you go to a charity event, you go to a brain cancer event, and it's a fun foundation where you go there to that foundation. And when you arrive there, it says brain cancer. You do not run up to the person who started it and said, hey, what about testicle cancer? Hey, 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 what about breast cancer? That person's going to say, oh, I'm... God bless you, but this is for brain. This is for brain cancer. But we can do a, a fundraiser later for that. But the point is, is that it's okay for there to be something there for something specific if something's going on. Right now, a lot of black people, or black women and men, are being targeted from the police. So what's wrong on saying Black Lives Matter and focusing on that? Just like we did, um, what was it? The fucking uh, bread people. Italy, Italy got attacked or something like that. The bread people, um, you know, Italy matters or something like that. You know? If there was a bunch of gay people getting killed because they were gay, what's wrong with hashtagging gay lives matter? You know, and this is the, these are the, what I'm talking about. You know, these are the losers that are playing PlayStation games, that are playing GTA for 15 hours a day, playing Xenoverse for 15 hours a day, playing Final Fantasy for 15 hours a day. Don't even got a job, don't even want one. They're cool with their mother and their father and, you know, buying them Mickey Mouse dolls and saying, honey, we love you, happy birthday. You're saying thank you while you're sitting on your couch that you didn't even wash for two years. Two years? I was on um, a couple of days ago. I was watching, um, I think it was uh, an episode of um, Dragon Ball. And um, it was an episode where Vegeta was just preaching about being a real man, you know? And when I heard that, I was like, wow, this is what all these losers, all these virgins need to hear. All of them. Every single one of them. You weren't instilled. The manly juice was not installed in your sphincter. You know? And that's what we're seeing today. That's what we're seeing today. I'm not even gonna get on I'm not even gonna get deep on where police started from. Because police officers started from police and slaves, making sure slaves were doing their jobs. But I'm going so deep on you that you don't even know where where your head is right now. You don't know what's going on because earlier you sucked cock. And we're dreaming about Sasuke. You were dreaming about Noctis. Double banging you. And you don't even know what to do. You're ready to hire now a, a Mexican Ronald McDonald. He's going to cry with tacos next. That's where you're leading this. You know, you got games like World of Final Fantasy that just look amazing, that look incredible. You know, the graphics are awesome. It's coming out for Vita and PS4. I think it's coming out for Xbox, isn't it? I don't remember. But, you know, it's coming out for all of these, these, all these, all, all, all the great games are coming out this year, I noticed, and next year. You know, I saw so, so Spellbound. That looks fucking smash. I saw a couple of games that just look amazing. And, you know, when I see this, you know, it reminds me like, like 
like a boxing, you know, like, 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 like the world's going pow, 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 get out of here, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. And I feel like all of these are signs. Follow me, follow me, follow me. All of these are signs of trolls days being dead. You're no longer trolling, right? You know, I was watching a YouTuber. He was new to me, new to me. Uh, I don't usually say people's names because most of them are frauds and losers. and They think they're doing something new, but they're not. Um, they think they're being real, but they're not. But I like this guy, Goon on Fire. If you ever see him, watch his shit. He does his GTA and COD and all those stuff. Or he's just trolling people. I like it because it's original. He's not trolling people off of the old 1950 and 40s insults. He's trolling people from new, new words. That's what I like. That's what I like. I also saw this new guy that my cousin showed me. Because my cousin's like part of that whole community. Names, um... Um, oh, I forget his name now. Shit. I don't remember his name, no. I don't remember his name. He's a black guy. Real cool dude, man. Um, but he's another one. He trolls people. And he's so original with it. You know? Um, you know, it's sad that that's, that's, that's the day we live in, though. We live in, a, we live in a world where people are playing Kingdom Hearts. And they're literally perverts, like like their cocks are literally ri rising seven inches when they see Mickey Mouse and Kingdom Hearts. That's absurd. It's absurd. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Because I'm going to tangent. I'm going to keep going on a roll, you know, to the point where I lose my, ins my, my sanity. You know? You know? Sad. So like every day, you know, I lead with words of inspiration. Words get you through your days. A poem that ends the video uh, with blessings. A lollipop. A lollipop was once created to suck on. Different flavors, root bear, cherry orange fruit but a lollipop is also a sign and a symbol it's a symbol that one day if you believe hard you the viewers believe really really hard one day you could suck at life perfectly become the ultimate sucker. Love you guys. Peace, love, and be wild. Fade away. Black